just wanted to give you guys an update here even though it's a holiday I'm gonna continue to routine I got back from vacation so thanks for everyone that was still watching the videos and supporting inside the discord uh, right now we got a nice move up here over uh, the last couple of days from basically 60,000 all the way to 66,000 we are long inside the discord uh, right now I closed a position by accident I was actually uh, <laughs> trying to just adjust it with like a take profit but I ended up closing it so I guess we bagged a 12 percent or so a uh, little win today nice little 12 percent we'll see how the other trades pan out but very happy with how things are going right now when we take a look at the chart here so we could be really in this one two one two setup which is extremely bullish we could also be inside of this bearish setup here that we have right now which would be a wxy with a deeper pullback for a lower wave two right so we, we need to be open for the to the idea that the wave two could still be in play here and if it is this abc is a flat and right now the flat target the sell area is right here at 65,000 uh, between 65,000 sorry to uh, I believe uh, 68,000 so anywhere in this area is a is a sell area so it's possible we could dump but right now the markets are trending towards uh, new all-time highs they continue to get bought up they continue to get pushed up so things are extremely uber uh, bullish right now in the stock market so sediment is very good for investors so i would i would have to say that the likelihood of this playing out uh is not the greatest right now especially when we take a look at market cipher so when we take a look at market cipher the new weekly candle looking very good minus 5 11 on the dual best strength index daily time frame also very good uh green money flow coming back in nice green dots signaling a bottom bullish dual bed strength index numbers the minus five and a 17 four hour time frame now this is where it gets a little bit dicey you do have a red dot here uh you know you could be possibly finishing up this impulse up and you know if it starts to roll over then you got your short confirmation but i wouldn't really want to short at these areas right now although bitcoin has been chopping uh inside of this range for the longest time ever we have not broken out yet and it continues to uh you know tease us here and there about when the breakout is going to happen you know there's videos all over youtube stuff like that but for now you know it wouldn't be the bad area you know to get a reversal but if it were to get out of control and you want to extend the way forward then there's that super bearish scenario of 42k but for me at least we're in some longs right now or Rack, racking in that money with the the, the garden rake i guess <laughs> but uh yeah let's take a look at wave edge as well so new weekly candle nothing four day three day nothing nothing two day nothing daily time frame that green cross played out four hour time frame uh these red crosses played out here but it was just a buy the dip opportunity and then one hour time frame so you are getting some selling smart money is taking some profits as the price makes its way up uh, 24 minute time frame nothing really going on here i don't want to really dive into the smaller time frames because i don't think it's gonna it's gonna be good analysis for people as you know as usual you know if you guys watch this video maybe four hours later then the one minute time frame analysis won't mean anything okay look at that we just got a new four hour candle so right now it's 18 and a minus three on the dual bed strength index so quite bearish right so let's see if we do end up playing out with a pullback before we wake up tomorrow morning and the markets gapped up again anyways have a wonderful evening guys uh, i'll continue to update you guys on my trade updates inside the discord so feel free to join whenever you want and have a wonderful day